Hey everyone, welcome back to the Let's Play East 3 Wanderers from East. We are continuing into this incredibly brutal area of the game. We are going to get through here using the item we picked up from that last boss, the Garnet Ring, or Bracelet. It's going to make the Blue Knight statue disappear so we can continue onward. Hooray, because I love this place so much I want to keep going. Going to take a quick detour down here. So we can get ourselves some battle armor. Best armor in the game, thank god. So I can certainly use some more defense here. Okay, we're gonna continue on with more of this shenanigans here. I'm actually gonna bust a save real quick because we have a boss coming up. I would like to be able to kill him without having to use a healing item so I can get my life restored and be in good shape for going after the um, next part of this area. Just like that. Really? Game? Come on. Adol, like, breathed on the axe and lost half his life. Is it going to be one of these days, game? Is it going to be one of these days? It obviously is. It obviously is. <laughs> Are you kidding? Did I even touch the spears that time? part of the game is just so ridiculously brutal. I mean, again, I have the best armor in the game, best shield and the best armor, and I'm still getting absolutely obliterated by these traps. Like, you mess up once and you might as well just reload. This was slightly fixed in the PSP version, but only so much. At least we got to the boss in good shape. Go ahead and equip the power ring. Fire doggy! Yay! Much easier in this version of the game than he was in the PSP version, where he was one of the more difficult bo bosses. This one you just need to duck at his feet, avoid his fire, and slash his face with the power ring equipped. And thankfully, thankfully, that restored our life. So let's go ahead and save again. What? It's okay, Eleanor, what's going on? Is that so? That's true, he does look pretty familiar. Whoa. What is that? Way. How do you figure? Open so easily? What are you smoking, Adel? Oh yeah, it opens so easily. All I need is this magical sphere, and I need to come into the church at the exact right time of day so the beam, the sunlight from the window can reflect off of the sphere and into the magical port on the door. What? So easy. Duh. Might as well just leave it open. God. <sighs> Got anything to say? I will be. Ah, uh, paranoid save. 
No oh, God. <laughs> I have no idea what these are. They're scary. Oh, gee, oh, that's like the worst possible spot for that thing. Jeez. Look at that. Still did 60, 71 points of damage? Seriously? Game? A man's voice echoes from within the dungeon. Childeros, the Blue Knight, has the key. Please get the key. Okay. Oh, God. That was kind of sudden. All right. Either this fight's going to be easy or I'm going to get destroyed. We'll see. All right. We got to wait for him to walk out of his bubble. We slash, run away, slash, run away, slash. Sometimes you won't hit him, but it's not worth staying because he hits pretty hard. And I'm really trying to preserve my ring power. This one is kind of a breather, but if you try to a frontal assault, he will destroy you if you don't retreat. He hits really hard. I got the prison key. All right, let's go. Let's go back and free them prisoners. Sup? You look familiar. Oh, all right, Cleric Pierre, I remember. I imagine not. Who are you? Oh my god, it's Robert! He's alive! That's weird. You got anything else to say? No? Alright. What's up with you? Because he's a crazy mofo? That's my guess. Oh, loots? Very good. You take care of the other prisoners. I'll continue onward. Nah, 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 nah. At least this place has a good soundtrack. Of course, you can pretty much say that for the whole game. Oh, yeah. Here's another area that's a pain. It's nothing with like the traps from earlier, but we got some very strong enemies. We got some new enemy types. I mean, these ow, ow, ow! That was stupid. I was trying to avoid these sniper things, man. These guys are crazy. Then you got these slimes down here. They're crazy. They do a lot of damage, and you gotta crouch to hit them. Oh, look at that. A chest up in the upper left. Look at that. I was taking damage from that somehow. And I don't know how. Oh, no! No, Hedel, no! God, that guy didn't respawn. I am so not taking a chance. At all? Why, why aren't you jumping, man? Is it something I said? I mean, I don't... Alright. Final ring in the game. Protection ring. It is amazing. It makes you completely invulnerable to damage. Wow, that sounds good. What's the downside? It drains ring energy at pretty much triple the rate the other rings do. So even if you have a full ring charge, you are not going to be using it for very long. But, hey, it's 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 a beast of a ring, I'll tell you. Ah, can't get up there. So we'll go this way. 
Here we are. The final weapon and the best weapon of the game. The flame sword. I wish I had more life, but what are you going to do? And check it out. It even changed color. It's orange now. Details, baby. Alright, on this part, we want to hop on this thing. Wait for it to go up so we can hop up here. And we drop all the way down, and we get through the door here. I don't think there was anything over this way, just to be sure. Nope, game call that way. Alright then. This, I like to just try to jump over them. These things still take a million hits, even with the new weapon. Did that slime hit me? I, I refuse to accept that. I think I'd... No, I think that's the right one. Yeah. How did that slime even hit me? I'm trying to preserve some energy here. The boss fight that's coming up is quite... Ah, whatever. The boss that's coming up is quite a beast. Don't ask me how that guy was hitting me, because I certainly couldn't tell you. Come on. I don't suppose there's like a... Uh. Come on, I'm not going to take that many hits in here. Next boss is hard enough. Seriously? I don't even know how he was hitting me there. I hate these oozes, man. This next boss is so hard to do on one life. Or, uh, you know, basically one life, you know, with an herb. <sighs> Be nice if there was an herb somewhere. Save into a completely different slot. Because I think the boss is coming. Oh, God! I completely forgot about you. I. Don't get how the slime's hitting me when it's not even touching me. Just need a little bit of life to get through that guy. Alright, slightly better. There we go. Go, Adel. Okay. This is going to be very interesting. I might as well just use the herb. First shot's going to kill me, so... Heal there. Alright, make another save. Okay, it's you again. That's unfortunate. Okay, well, that's pretty. Oh, God! Let's see, let's try to outpower him. Where are you? 
Do you see what ridiculous crap that is? He killed me in three hits. That's why I wasn't looking forward to this. Only chance I have is probably this. And switch back. Whoa. Abuse my amulet. Whoa, whoa. This is what I would call like the first really legitimate difficult fight. I mean, if you didn't come in here with ring energy and an amulet, I am and an herb, I just don't know what to tell you. And not to mention the protection ring is pretty easy to miss. I actually missed it my first playthrough. Really? You admit defeat? You're giving up? Really? Yeah, it is all your fault. Which is your fault. Obviously. We, huh? Someone, huh? Of course, it's up to me. Hop, oh, just like that. My bad. My bad. I I got this. Hey, Elena. Out of nowhere, an evil voice fills the air. Uh oh. Oh, she poofed. I was going to go there anyway, but okay. <sighs> yeah. The people of Redmont? Uh, you know, I think you've done enough for them that one little mistake, I, I think they'll let pass. I mean, no one liked Elena anyway. Happy Town music! Alright, and we're gonna see what Mr. Gardner and his buddies have to say next time. Thanks everyone for watching. I am certainly glad to be out of the Blastine Castle. Hardest area in the game, I'd, uh, definitely. But thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Everybody have a good day.